ESS is located on the outskirts of Lund, a city with a long, rich history. It's built on the border between the city and the countryside on 75 hectares of land, and it is here the future will be formed. This is where it all starts, the iron source manufactured by INFN in Italy. Plasma is created from hydrogen gas and the protons are separated from the electrons. These protons are then drawn into the accelerator where they're accelerated to speeds approaching the speed of light. The 602.5 meter long accelerator is divided into a warm section, a cold section, and a section for which is set aside for future upgrades. What we see here is mostly the cryogenic system that will cool the accelerator. While the accelerator tunnel is mostly 8 meters below ground, the equipment that powers it is placed in the gallery on ground level. They are connected through stubs placed along the tunnel. When the protons hit the tungsten target wheel, the spallation occurs and the neutrons are released from the tungsten nuclei. A moderator then collects and moderates the neutrons before they are guided towards the instruments. ESS will have three instrument halls surrounding the target. The largest is for the long instruments, which are up to 180 meters from the target. ESS will have 15 instruments online by 2026 and has planned for a total of 22 state-of-the-art instruments. This is where the magic takes place. Each instrument is tailor-made by scientists, for scientists, to make the most of the neutrons. As a facility focused on the users, ESS will provide the scientists with beam time at an instrument, as well as a scientist that can help these visiting researchers make the most out of every instrument. The ESS campus, where the scientists will stay during their time at ESS, includes a restaurant, auditorium, conference rooms and office space for all ESS employees. We will move in at the beginning of 2021. ESS has more than 500 employees, representing over 50 nationalities. First science is set to take place in 2023. We will deepen our understanding of the world around us and perform research on scales never seen before. Together, we're on our way to change the world for the better.